Good morning. I am now back in the Black Mountains in the western section of the Brecon Beacons National Park. And today I am in the town of Krakow. And I am just starting out on the climb up to Table Mountain or Krig Huel, as I believe they say in Welsh. Uh, from there I'm heading on up to Pen Kerig Calch, um, which is the summit a little bit further up, before heading further north to the final summit on my walk today, which is Penalt Maur. From there I will swing back, pretty much retracing my steps, um, back to Krakow. I'm not entirely sure of the distance today, but I'll update you a little bit later as I'm recording this uh, walk, but I think it's quite a long one. Weather looks pretty decent, so uh, should be a good day. And as always, I'll keep you up to speed as we make our way along. Talk to you soon. Now from the start point, or at least the point where you start heading across fields, you think everything is gonna be all about the, the fantastic views, but we haven't actually got there yet. And now we're passing through this really gorgeous um, wooded area, flanked by woods on one side and hedges on, on the other for the most part. And then of course this lovely river down to your left hand side. And it's almost like the views are being shielded from you for now to make you appreciate them a whole lot more when you get a little bit further up the hill. Looking forward to it. Okay, so after the walk up through the wooded area, you eventually break out of the woods into this beautiful fern-covered landscape and the path just leads gently through these, uh, through these ferns and uh, probably just over my right shoulder you can see Table Mountain behind and uh, the view down over Krikal behind me. It's actually quite a lot, a lot harder this initial climb than, uh, than I thought. It's uh, fairly consistent right the way through and uh, yeah It'll be quite a relief when we get up to the ridge because then at least uh, it's nice and flat. So we'll see you up there. Here I am at the summit of Table Mountain or Krig Huel. Hope I haven't absolutely murdered that name uh, for you Welsh speakers out there. Um, so now we're looking back towards Krakow behind me and the somewhat iconic Sugarloaf behind me now. Um, now, Table Mountain was once the, um, the home of a uh, Iron Age hill fort, which is not at all surprising when you see its location. Absolutely ideal. It really is stunning up here. Uh, next, I'm heading right up to the top of the peak up there, uh, which is going to work my way up to um, Pencari Calc uh, before I continue around the ridge um, up to Penalt Maur. So uh, we'll see you up there. Okay, I've reached my second peak of the day, trick point for Pencarig Calc right behind me. And the next point, and where I turn around, is uh, Penalt Maur, which is right over there. Um, now, from Krikowl, it took about an hour and a quarter to get to Table Mountain, and about another hour to get from Table Mountain up to here and not quite sure how long this bit's gonna take. So uh, when I get there, I'll let you know. When I left Pen Kerig Calf, I um, just followed the path that, that pretty much stuck to the ridge um, and if you actually look at this part of the walk that I'm on, if you look at it on Google Satellite, for example, it actually looks like a foot. And the part I'm on right now, I've actually reached the sole, which is the ridge behind me here, which is affording me these incredible views. 
Um, and I'm heading up here in a minute to uh, the final peak at the end, Penalt Maur, uh, and that is would be the toes pointing north. Um, but for now, um, we're looking out to the west, and unfortunately, um, right now the central uh, Brecon beacons are shrouded in clouds, so there's no uh, there's no view of Penavan Cribbin uh, today, for example. But uh, some of the views out here are absolutely stunning. And fingers crossed, as we get to the top, uh, to Penalt Maud, there's going to be some good views uh, looking up the Black Mountain Range as well. So fingers crossed. See you in a bit. Here I am at the summit of Penalt Maur at 719 meters above sea level. This is the turning point in the walk today. This is as far as I'm going to be going. So it's now just, well, pretty much retracing my steps, but I'm going to be sticking to the opposing ridge just to get a little bit of uh, variety. Um, out to the north, you can see uh, Weinbach, the highest point in the Black Mountains, one that I did fairly recently via the Dragon's Back. Um, Munnath Troid, um, one that I'm yet to do, I'm looking forward to doing that. And Lang Langors Mountain, uh, Didam and I did that a few years back. Um, another really pleasant walk. So um, it was about an, an hour to get here from Penn at Kerig Kalch. Um, so I've got a bit of a trek back now, so it'll be interesting to see what the distance is and the time at the end of this hike, but it's quite a long one. So I better get cracking and I'll talk to you later. Okay, I'm, I'm on the last section before we rejoin civilization. Um, it's been a long one. It has been a long, long hike. Um, although we've still got a little ways to go back to the car. Um, I've just checked the hiking app and uh, we're, we're already at 16 and a half kilometers and uh, approaching the six hour mark. Um, yes, I did stop for about an hour um, at Penalt Maur, um, but that was the only stop I did have the whole way along. So uh, yeah, it's a long, you know, is a long and challenging hike. The initial uh, stage up to uh, Table Mountain is, you know, it's fairly moderate in difficulty. It's a good consistent climb. Um, and also from Table Mountain up to um, Penkeri Cal. But after that, it's, it's generally fairly flat. It's just very, very long. Um, so, and the scenery is beautiful in, in every way, but what I will say, you know, if you want to cut the walk short, just head up to Table Mountain. It's a really nice sort of two and a half to three hour uh, round trip, out and back the same route. If you want to turn it into a moderate affair, just head up, add the extra hour and a half to two hours by taking in um, Pen Kerry Calc as well. Um, but if you want to go the full hog, um, it's a good, probably, it's probably going to be about 18 k's in the end. Now if you do want to check out the, the full route once complete, um, you can either head over to um, Outdoor, Outdoor Active, which is the hiking app that we use here, um, or just head over to Roaming Spices and uh, you'll find the, the route published there anyway. So from a, from a tired me, in Krakow, um, until next time, Take care. Bye-bye.